Welcome to the second staff communications forum for the year 2015. As part of the company's growth strategy, Total Kenya has continued to expand its market presence by opening new service stations in new and existing frontiers. Since March 2015, five new service stations have been commissioned. The stations are Total Isebania, Total Busia, Total Matu, Total Oletepis, and Total Wate. The Total Fuel Card continues to be the number one fleet management solution for fleet owners due to its superior technology, safety, and reliable transaction recording. In the month of April, the Total Fuel Card team reiterated its product offering by partnering with Securex Security Group for the supply of the Fuel Card solution. In addition, the team held a joint sales promo with Kingsway Tires, where customers purchasing Kingsway Tire products were given preloaded Total Fuel cards with a set amount. During the month of June to September, Total Kenya ran a media campaign to promote the Rubia brand. The campaign ran mainly on TV and radio, but was also featured on billboards, magazines, posters, and social media. Product endorsements by Modern Coast, Easy Coach, and Mungai Workshop featured in the campaign. In order to improve the company's business relationships with its suppliers and service providers, the Purchasing and Supplies Department held its Maiden Contractors Seminar in the month of April. The seminar sought to deliberate on issues affecting suppliers and their relations with the company as well as to communicate the company's present commitments in regards to safety and compliance. In the month of May, the Netcom management team held the Netcom Managers Business Review Meeting at the Staff Club and Training Center in Halingam. The agenda of the meeting was to review the progress and performance of Netcom run service stations, discuss the issues affecting the business, and also set plans for the future of the business. During the meeting, the Netcom management team also recognized the most outstanding Netcom managers by giving them awards for best performance. In the same month, the Head Office Business Review Committee held its first AAA review meeting for the year 2015. The purpose of the meeting was to review the company's accomplishments in regard to the AAA strategies implemented within Total Kenya, to benchmark and set targets for the year as per company's AAA objectives. To further enhance the business partnership between Total Kenya and Visa Kenya that was forged in the year 2015, the two companies together with Barclays Bank Kenya launched the Total Freedom with Visa promotion in the month of June. The promotion sought to increase customer awareness on availability of the Visa payment option at the Total service stations. Modalities of the promo were such that any customer making payments for Total services at a Total service station using their Visa debit or credit card stood a chance of winning a year's supply of fuel, a full tank of fuel, or instant Visa and Total merchandise. The promo saw about 45 winners going home with fuel awards. It also greatly improved usage of Visa payment platforms with the Total service station network. The future of energy will be defined by the use of sustainable and renewable eco-friendly energy. It is on this premise that the Total Group is actively pursuing advancements in solar energy. In this light, Total Kenya has expanded its solar business segment through the active proposition of portable solar lanterns, especially for populations living in areas outside the electric grid. To further extend its reach, 
The company partnered with Solar Kiosk Kenya to set up community kiosks that are fully powered by solar energy. Besides selling household consumables, the kiosks sell portable solar lanterns and mobile phone charging points for the communities they serve. In the month of August 2015, the Total Fuel Card team held its 2015 wave of the Total Fuel Card customer seminars in Nairobi, Mombasa, and Western Kenya. The seminars, which are annual events, are usually a fruitful conference of the business and as customers where issues affecting the card business are discussed, as well as technological improvements and advancements of the fuel card system. The seminars are a key feedback point for service improvement. Just you, just me Let's find a cozy spot to cuddle and woo Just us, just we I've missed an awful lot, my trouble is you Oh gee, what are your charms for? What are my arms for? Use your imagination, just you just me. Total Quartz. Keep your engine younger for longer. Action Against Malaria in sub saharan Africa is one of Total Group's key CSR commitments. The group helps fight malaria by donating treated mosquito nets to children under the age of 12 years. During this year's World Malaria Day celebrations, Total Kenya donated over 300 treated mosquitoes to SOS Children's Village in Buruburu. This was in addition to the annual support the company gives the home. Road safety awareness is the most important CSR commitment for the Total Group. Total Kenya together with Safeway Right Way, other corporates such as Safaricom, EABL, Lafarge, to mention but a few, and United Nations celebrated the 2015 UN Road Safety Week at the St. George's Primary School, where the managing director presided over the graduation of road safety ambassadors who had completed the On the Road to Safety program, which is conducted by Total Kenya and the Safeway Right Way NGO. During this year's Global Diversity Week celebrations, the company sought to celebrate diversity in the society by extending its support for minority groups through joining the fight against stigmatization of autism in the society. The company mobilized some members of staff to visit the City Primary Autism Unit so as to spend time with autistic children schooling there. Along with the visit, the company purchased teaching and learning materials for the staff and pupils in the school. In addition, the company treated the pupils to a special menu it sponsored. Total Kenya continues to support environmental conservation efforts by the Rhino Arc Foundation through participation in the annual Rhino Charge competition by way of fuel and lubricant sponsorship for logistical operations. The company donated to Tal Fuel products worth 700,000 Kenyan shillings. In keeping with tradition, about 70 members of staff joined droves of other Kenyans in marking the 2015 Mata Hatran fundraising marathon. The Mata Hatran is an annual marathon organized by the Mata Hospital with the aim of raising money for aiding medical expenses for children from disadvantaged backgrounds suffering from heart conditions. On June 12, 2015, Total Kenya held its 61st Shareholders Annual General Meeting at the Safari Park Hotel. In the meeting, shareholders got a chance to interrogate the company's performance as well as discuss growth plans and prospects. The Board of Directors also generously approved the issuance of a two-lamp solar sundial kit to all shareholders. In the same month, June 2015, the Total Lubricants team and the Alfa Romeo Owners Club Kenya held the 2015 edition of the Total Quartz Economic Run, which is an annual race for Alfa Romeo vehicles where entrants compete to determine the most fuel-efficient vehicle of an 84-kilometer stretch from Nairobi to Naivasha. 
This year's race was won by Shailesh Chandaria, who won the race by using 1.21 liters of fuel over the 84 kilometers distance in his 1.8 cc 1983 Alfa Romeo Giulietta. On July 14, 2015, Total Kenya joined about 50 French organizations with a foothold in Kenya in celebrating this year's Bastille Day celebrations at the official residence of the Ambassador of France to Kenya. The event was attended by a number of staff members led by the managing director. Total Kenya was among the sponsors of the event and used the occasion to showcase its solar products. Total Kenya through the Total Eco Challenge Program and the Kenya Forest Service held the 2015 Total Tree Conference at the Windsor Hotel and Country Club. The conference brings together interested partners on environmental conservation, environmental scientists, environmental scholars and policy makers to have a discourse on issues affecting tree farming as well as action plans for development of the practice. The discourse this year focused on the subject of tree economics. The Total Motor Show is undoubtedly the biggest motor show in East and Central Africa, as proven by the success of the 2015 Total Motor Show that was held on September 18th to the 20th at the KICC grounds. This year's show saw the showcasing of an array of the latest motor vehicles of all classes available in the Kenyan market. The 2015 show is the biggest yet in the 20 plus years of its existence. The event saw an attendance of over 25,000 attendees and over 80 exhibitors. In its continued effort to promote road safety, Safeway Rightway simulated an accident in September at the Machakos Junction to test the county's preparedness to respond to a major road disaster. Participants and sponsors at the drill included Total Kenya, County Government of Machakos, Kenya Police Service, St. John's Ambulance, North Star Alliance, Bamburi Cement Company, and the Petroleum Institute of East Africa, among others. Border Border volunteers who participated in defensive driving course were also awarded. On the same breath, the Total Eco Challenge program hosted its 2015 Gala Awards Dinner at the Carnival Restaurant on September 23rd. The dinner is an annual award ceremony for persons and institutions who have done a tremendous job in tree planting for the past year. The invited are usually bestowed upon tree ambassadorship or awarded trophies. The 2015 edition of the Concours d'Elegance was held on September 27 at the Gong Racecourse. Total Kenya participated in this year's event by sponsoring the inspection ramp, providing display mats for motorcycles, and setting up an exhibition tent for Total products. As true to its reputation, this year's event was full of class, glamour, and sophistication. As part of the Be Alive program, the company frequently organizes blood donation drives for members of staff at the head office and depots. In April, the company held this year's first blood drive at the Total Limuru Road service station and targeted to include members of staff from the service station, KFC Limuru Road branch, the head office and the surrounding neighborhood. Due to the change of location, the drive turned out to be one of the most successful drives ever held. Over 50 pints of blood were collected. In the month of May, the company welcomed seven new young graduate management trainees, otherwise known as YGMTs. The seven were the successful candidates from the highly competitive 2015 YGMT recruitment drive held earlier in the year. These trainees are designated to strengthen the company through the injection of newer and fresh ideas as well as benefit from a comprehensive active training experience with Total Affiliates. The trainees are part of the 200 young graduates that the Total Group targets to train in the AMO perimeter by 2017. 
The Greatness United Program, G United, a one-year national volunteer program initiated by the Presidency and implemented by the Ministry of Education, Science and Technology, recently held its first career fair at the Lyco Regency in September. Ms. Ada Eze, the Managing Director of the Tal Kenya Group, was among panelists giving career advice to over 140 graduates in attendance. Total Kenya also had a stand at the career fair. Total Kenya held the second edition of the Youth Life Skills and Mentorship Arcade on August 21st to 22nd, 2015. The event is an annual mentorship workshop targeting teenagers and young adults who fall under 13 to 24 years age bracket for the purpose of educating, guiding and counseling them on day-to-day -day issues affecting them such as drugs and alcohol, education, careers, internet addition, internet privacy and talent exploration. The Global Give Back Circle GGBC held a fundraising parade dubbed the GGBC's Educator Parade on Saturday 3rd of October at Karura Forest. The aim of the parade is to raise funds for educating girls in West Pokot. Total Kenya staff, along with their children, attended the event that was alive with games and live band performances. Music 